I went to an art exhibit with uh, someone that had a keen understanding of art and I thought I, I thought I was I thought I understood art I, I was even snobby about it you know I took a lot of art history classes and showed a little promise when I was younger um, but I learned something uh, that day at the art museum and it, it, we were seeing an exhibit uh, of Richard Tuttle. And though I'd heard the name, I did not know his work at all. People were lined up for a long way. And this was at uh, San Francisco, MoMA. And um, there was a ton of people and the tickets were really expensive. And um, you could see the people going in, in the line, but you couldn't see the people coming out because you went, came out down some stairs. Um, and so you couldn't see people's reactions. And so I couldn't like glean any idea of, you know, what they, what they were seeing. You could see, you could only see the piece one at a time, one person at a time. And uh, she went first and she went out and I was like, okay, get it together. You gotta get in there and see this amazing work of art, all right? Be present. And you go down this hallway, and the hallway, you know, it's all white. There's nothing on the walls. And it's it's kind of a long hallway. And you get all the way down to the end of the hallway. And on the wall, a white wall and a white room with nothing else there is a, a piece of rope nailed to the wall. And... Um, didn't understand it. I didn't get it. I was like, oh my god. All of this, all of this buildup, all of everything. And it's a string nailed to the wall. What the hell? Why? How is this art? How you know I bitched about it. You know, I think I bitch now. The artwork was a piece of string nailed to the wall by Richard Tuttle and uh, um, after complaining for so long about the art piece um, you know through lunch through most of dinner um, she turned to me and she said uh, maybe that's it, that it made you feel something, even though it was confusion and anger and fear, maybe art isn't always supposed to be about making you happy. Maybe sometimes art is about making you feel something, even if it's squeamish or cringy or somebody presenting something to you and giving you a feeling that you didn't have before and then that's all I ever thought about from then on and you know you know me I think art is well the reason we're here and sometimes the artist isn't here to make you happy isn't here to make you feel safe isn't here to make you feel comfortable here to make you feel something. It's your total. Thanks.